And we have engine start. It's one of the greatest scientific missions of modern times. And lift off. Decollage, lift off from a tropical rainforest to the edge of time itself. James Webb begins a voyage back to the birth of the universe. And it's the biggest telescope ever sent into space. Is nominal. A joint effort by the US, European and Canadian space agencies, it's 100 times more powerful than its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope. It's designed to see deeper in space and further back in time than ever before. It's a time machine. It's going to take us back to the very beginnings of the universe. Not only are astronomers excited to see the birth of the very first stars and galaxies, they're hoping the telescope will reveal distant planets which could provide evidence of life beyond Earth. Thousands of people have worked on the $12 billion project for over 30 years. The world gave us this telescope and we, we handed it back to the world today. Separation Web Space Telescope. Go Web! In the next two weeks, the telescope will unfurl to the size of a tennis court before it reaches its destination, one and a half million kilometres from Earth. Go web, go web. It was a big sigh of relief that things are actually moving in the way that they're supposed to for this mission, but a huge amount of excitement for, you know, what's to come. And there it is. There's your critical call. James Webb not only has legs, but it has power. For now, they're celebrating the start of a mission that's about to transform how we see the universe. Meredith Griffiths, ABC News.